when I was very young. You know, Quando Free Holbin, okay, you know, he said the Cosas no told us the end, right? And you know, I made some mistakes, like most people. I guess my mistakes were a little bit bigger as were my successes. Pero at this point in my life now, I've learned from that. You know, you know, hoy entiendo que no es um, solo, um, you know, cuantos dolores you, know, you gano que, um, you know, importa. Es otras cosas también. See, I can speak Spanish when I really want to, right? If I really want to get my point across, I can't always speak that. I probably made 800 mistakes along the way. But the point is I realize now at this point in my life, it's not about how much money you can make, how fast you can make it, how ruthless you can be, how many great deals you can negotiate, and how many dollars ultimately end up in your bank account, how many wonderful trips you can take. I love money, and I make a lot of money, but I know there's a higher purpose as well, and that is that I also choose to live my life in a way where I get to empower and lift up all the people around me as well. So in my mind now, if I'm gonna make money doing something, I need to make sure that every person whose lives gets touched as a result of me being in business, me, me essentially you know, displaying my power, projecting my power out, because that's what you do when you have a business. When you're a business owner, you, you're able to project power, your power, your force out into the world. I want to make sure everyone that gets touched by that force benefits. And that doesn't mean that's not mutually exclusive with not making a lot of money. So you remember, I, 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 the purpose of a business, right, is, is essentially to deliver value. That's what businesses do. We are in the business of delivering some sort of value. So there's some sort of pain point some sort of need out in the marketplace. And then we start a business to essentially serve a certain need, to fill a need, to solve a problem. And then hopefully, if we're smart and good at what we do, we can figure out how to charge enough money for the, for the service or the good that we sell, the service you provide or the good we sell, so at the end of the day, what it costs us to deliver that good or service is less than we can charge the money that someone will pay us to provide that good or service. The point I'm making is that to me there's nothing wrong with making tons and tons of money and buying lots of nice things and living a wonderful life and helping everyone you like. That's a great thing. But what I don't think is great, if you do that without the idea that the money I make is as a result of giving people value. And I'm entitled to charge for that value. And people will always pay for value. And that's how I make a lot of money. So in that regard, it's really simple when it comes to how do I make more money? That question, how do you make more money? Well, I don't really have to even ask myself that question anymore. The question I ask myself every morning is, how do I help more people solve their problem? How do I reach more people? How do I empower more people? Because I know that if I do that, if I can solve more people's problems, if I can empower more people, guess what? I'll figure out a way to get paid. I'll, I'll monetize that value. But what I don't do is just try to make money for the sake of making money. And I think it's a very, the reason I'm starting off with this thought is because as entrepreneurs, it, it gets sometimes a bit strange in the weeds when we're, you know, in the day-to-day -day grind and stuff. We kind of forget, you know, why we're doing what we're doing, what the purpose of what we do really is. At the end of the day, as an entrepreneur, what your business is, is delivering value to someone or something, some group. You're delivering value, and in the world we live in, thankfully, you're entitled to get paid for that value, right? And then you want to run your business, the operations, in such a way that you can deliver that to many, many people at a profit. And that's how great businesses get built. That's how 
how they grow, and that's what sustains them. In other words, if, if you miss that step in the equation, you just about like, how much money can I make? I don't really care who gets value or not. You can still make money in the short term.